And Dave Fransman went looking for answers to that question. Dave, uh, will the public ever get a chance to see some of the details involved with this firing? Uh, Beth and Bruce, attorneys that I spoke with said if it ever goes to court, well, the chances are very good that you're going to see the details because it will be part of the court process. Now, for municipal employees, it's probably yes if the worker requests a civil service hearing. But some don't think a blanket yes for all personnel records for public workers in any case is a good idea. It is unusual in the extreme for the, the, the head of the government unit uh, to speak about a pending uh, personnel matter. Cedar Rapids attorney uh, Bill Romerman has represented a lot of public employees and police uh, officers in job disputes. But he says the dispute between the governor and a former DCI agent is something he's never quite seen before. But the question of whether or not to release information in a personnel file is more straightforward. If after reading that report, I intended to go ahead and file a wrongful termination action in court, then I would bring the report out now because it's going to come out sooner or later. Romerman says if the Headland case winds up in court, the public would learn what's involved beyond this speeding incident. Civil service cases also tend to wind up with public disclosure, although public workers can ask for a private hearing. But one lawmaker and lawyer says Iowa Code allows most details in a public employee's personnel file to stay private for good reasons. You look at a case like this and you might say, yeah, we'd sort of like to learn more. But the problem is, what if they've had, uh, had health problems? Uh, what if they've had um, personal uh, problems in their family that they need to talk to their employer about? Now, another way that information about this case might get, uh, get to be public knowledge is if there's an unemployment claim filed. Now, the results of that contested claim, uh, if it goes to a hearing, would also be part of Iowa's open records law. And uh, the attorneys I spoke with said that uh, if it goes to court as they expect, then that's when we're going to hear some of the details of what's going on with It'll this. It'll come out then. Yes. Thanks, Thank Dave. you, Dave.